This is Mike Decker with the National Wet Service in San Angelo, Texas. This briefing has been updated just after 6 a.m. Thursday morning. We had uh, low clouds across much of west central Texas, south of the Interstate uh, 20 corridor this morning. There's also patchy dense fog across much of the area, uh, also uh, south of the Interstate uh, 20 corridor. Uh, dense fog had reduced visibility to less than a quarter mile at Sonora and it was about uh, one half mile in Brownwood. A lot of other places were in the one to three mile uh, category. However, some of the lower uh, valley areas may see, still see uh, some, uh, some visibilities near zero. The, the good thing this, this morning, however, we have a surface uh, low that will be developing in Panel, moving across Oklahoma. So bring uh, uh, dry southwest winds and we're anticipating the fog and the low clouds to dissipate by mid-morning. The dense fog advisory for the eastern half of west central Texas will be expiring around 9 a.m. this morning. West winds will be increasing to 10 to 20 miles an hour. You can see some a little bit higher gusts there in the big country in the 15 to 25. As we look towards uh, the week ahead, uh, it looks like uh, Friday will be very similar to today, to today with uh, temperatures in the, uh, in the lower 60s, lower and mid 60s. Uh, Abilene looks like around 62, San Angelo may around 65. This as a uh, little surface uh, low moves across North Texas. Winds won't be quite as uh, strong, but we're still looking for west winds 10 to 20 miles an hour. A cold front will be moving through Friday night. It will bring much colder temperatures for the weekend. We're looking for highs in the 40s in the big country and uh, down in southward in the Concho Valley, mainly, mainly in the 50s. Uh, we're still expecting temperatures to fall below the freezing mark uh, uh, Sunday morning with temperatures uh, right around uh, 29 in San Angelo and up in the Abilene area around 28. An upper level disturbance will move over early next week. There could be a slight chance of uh, uh, light rain uh, uh, mixed with even a little bit of light snow up in the big country. Rainfall months, if we do have them, will be quite light, however, and we're not expecting any accumulations. Down further south in the Concha Valley, it looks like it'll be all rain, and uh, uh, again, months will be quite light, uh, perhaps just uh, a few hundreds of an inch, uh, most areas probably in the trace. Once we get past Monday, however, we're looking for uh, sun come out to come out. Uh, temperatures back uh, in the 50s, uh, San Angelo lower 50s, maybe right around 50 degrees or so, and up in the big country, maybe some upper 40s, somewhere it'll be just uh, north of the interstate uh, 20 corridor. This has been Mike Decker with the National West Service, San Angelo, Texas.